I love, I love what he said. The left wing and the right wing both help the same bird fly. It's true. Right? Straight facts right there. Hi guys, this is Play It Again. I am Ginger. And I am Mike and he is Tom McDonald. And uh, we were surprisingly pleased by our first Tom McDonald reaction. Yes, and a few since actually. Yeah. Okay, so we skipped the uh, Ben Shapiro one. We're going to just skip that one. <laughs> You don't Sorry, think Ben's got rap chops? Regardless of how you feel about Ben Shapiro, I can't stand his voice. It's just it's nothing personal. It's just the sound thing for me. Okay. Fair but enough. This one's called The Machine, and knowing Tom McDonald's um, politics, I suspect I know the machine he's talking about, and I am equally filled with hatred. Are you inclined to rage against it? <sighs> Indeed. <laughs> In many forms. Actually, I do at all times and every day. Okay, are <laughs> you ready it. to hear the... Do Let's it. Let's fight it. I am not Republican. I am not a liberal. Why the hell can't I just be American without getting political? The system gonna suppress us all. They don't care about the cost. How's this a democracy when we got communists in charge? Cancel culture Nazis. All they're missing is the swastikas. Honestly, this is a psychological holocaust. Pumping propaganda through the screen and straight into your brain. You ain't on a plantation, but you definitely still a slave. Race theory is indoctrinating children. Tell blacks they're disadvantaged. Tell whites they got white privilege. What a brilliant way to reinforce division. If whites believe they have it easy, they will never help you the system and now they burn in books in untraditional ways that has traded newspapers for the digital age now the facts can be deleted with no physical flames that has changed the information and the truth gets erased they keep screaming to wake up but they're all woke not away we know the system has failed us and all the media is fake i swear the government hates us heavy I am not a liberal. Progressive and traditional are hitmen hired to kill the individual. They label people red or blue, divide us. They don't ever help. They want you thinking left or right, so you ain't thinking for yourself. Go ahead and vote, because both the parties are the same side. Two teams, one coach, controlled by the same guys. Left wing, right wing, both help the same bird fly. Brainwashing everybody at the same time. The internet was once a place that we could get our facts from. Now it's been monopolized. It's Google or it's Amazon. Who fact checking the fact checkers? I can answer that one. The people who control the narratives through the platform. Let me break this down for you, simple as I can, Kate. They use social conditioning to put you in the rat race. It doesn't matter if you're first or third or if you're last place. You're still a rat, and they're the cats who kill you so you can't escape. They keep screaming to wake up, but they're all woke. I am not a liberal. I am just a man who knows they're scared of a nation that's thinking critical. They kill us or they lock us up for nothing like we're criminals. Divide us because they know that unified we are invincible. Questioning the government's agenda is controversial, but promoting guns and liquor in our music is commercial. They're confusing us for pronouns they made up to make us triggered. You can call me what you want, but just don't call me late for dinner. School teaches you to learn and never teaches you to think. So you absorb misinformation, then you practice what they preach. You ain't free. Can't you see that's how they want you to act? That's called conforming to the norm. You don't need freedom for that. I'm I'm not Republican or liberal or left wing or right leaning. I took the red pills because that's who's fighting for my freedoms. And you don't need to choose to be accepted. They both fake teams. Evil runs the world now like hell ain't got no vacancy. They keep screaming to wake up, but they This dude is my spirit animal. <laughs> yeah. It's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> I love, I love what he said. The left wing and the right wing both help the same bird fly. It's true. Right? Straight facts right there. And that's the thing, right? Like we were, we've always been really politically in tune and relatively active for a long time. And it, it took a long time for me to figure out the side I was on was really actually the same. <laughs> yeah. 
It's the same bird. And then you realize it's like, why am I doing all this, yeah. right? Like, it, this is just another way for them to chain you, right? Uh, they, they make you, f he, he's absolutely right. They make you feel like you belong here, but it's just a way to, to kind of coddle you and mollify you. I, I was never good at conforming. No, you're terrible at that. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm with you, baby. Uh, yeah, well. <laughs> Well, the, in, in fairness, those are like the canaries in the coal mine, right? The, yeah. They're always the first to go. What yeah. the hell, right? Yeah, yeah. Why am I not free to not conform in, um, in all kinds of ways that seem harmless? Yeah, well, those of you who aren't overly familiar with this channel won't understand until now when I tell you that uh, one of the big reasons we left or in some manners fled Canada, where we lived our whole lives, was precisely this problem, mm -hmm. the fear that uh, we couldn't continue speaking our minds and saying what we thought without uh, a significant amount of government interference and persecution, to yeah. be honest, to be well, fair. Ask the, ask the people who donated to the truckers convoy and had their bank accounts frozen if we were right or wrong. Right. Mm -hmm. I saw that and said, man, I hate being right all the friggin' time. Tom seems to get it. Yeah, he gets it for sure. Yeah, that was actually, aside from the politics, which I could spend hours ranting about, right? <laughs> <laughs> Not as musically pleasingly as Tom does, but uh, aside from the politics, the song was really good. I actually really liked the melodic bits quite a bit. Yeah, I'm not a huge rap fan, right? So, but... Uh, but it was not off-putting rap. No, and when you're listening to the lyrics, right, you're kind of keeping track of those and, and you're enmeshed in them and, and following the storyline of that. Mm -hmm. So it's it's not so much um, about the delivery yeah. as it is about the message. So yeah. it, it, it overpowers the delivery for me. But yeah, the musical parts were really good. I liked the sound of that. It had a bit of an ominous feel though. <laughs> yeah. Well... Makes sense, right? Yeah, it really does. I do not envy our American friends and what they're about to go through because I think this election season is going to be it's real be, hell on earth. It's going to be crazy. Yeah, it really will for them. Uh, I mean, maybe so in Canada too, but like less so. Well, that's, that's less next guns. year's problem, probably. <laughs> it's true, but you know what I mean, though, right? Like, I think things are coming to a head. I I think I'm very, very glad that we're shoehorned away. My head is very, very remote my head and is, with a lot of food supply. My head is down, down here in a remote part of a remote country. Yes. And I like it that and way. And we have our, we grow our own food, which right now I think is the smartest thing anybody can do. So get yourself a little piece of land somewhere, wall it off, and uh, keep your head down as much as you can for now. And when all the fur is done flying, be ready to rebuild. That's what we're doing. And in the meantime, you can just play that one again for as long as we have internet. Live it, love it, learn it.